Restoring and reviving old photos has never been that easy. With Comfy UI, it only will take you few clicks. Learn how with Flux Context and Quen Edit. You choose. Let's get started. The workflows are already available as templates in Comfy UI. We will just make few changes to use GGUF models, prompting and visualization. Let's start with Flux Context. As usual, if you do not have the models installed, you will need to download them. You can click on the download buttons or use the URLs to download them. In the documentation of Comfy UI, you can find detailed instructions of the context template, including where the models should be placed. For this tutorial, we will use the GUF Q8 model of Flux Context. It needs to be placed in the Diffusion Models folder. I leave the link in the description. To load GGUF models, we need to have the GGUF model loader installed. Go to the Manager and Custom Nodes Manager. Then search for Comfy UI GGUF and install it. For the image comparer node, we will use the RG3 Comfy Custom Node package. And to improve the prompting, we are going to use the Comfy UI LLM toolkit. This pack allows us to interact via APIs with ChatGPT, Gemini, or any other LLM model we use. These custom nodes are optional but make easier to work in this workflow. After the custom nodes are installed, restart Comfy UI. We will not use the FP8 context model, so we add a UNET GGUF loader. Select the Q8 quantized flux context model. Connect the model to the K sampler. You can delete now the diffusion model loader. Swap the clip models in the dual clip loader. Load now the image you want to restore. Let's use a simple prompt to restore the photo. To compare the before and after, we add the image compare node from RG3. Let's try now to run the workflow. No need to change anything else yet. A simple prompt is not enough to get the results we want. We need to have a better one. We can try to create a better prompt ourselves, but LLM Toolkit can help us with that. Add the context system prompt text. Select the context auto prompt preset. This preset consists of instruction that describes how an LLM should later write a good prompt. As you see, the content preset defines an instruction to the LLM. The instruction defines which tasks to perform and how to write the prompt for Flux Context, depending on a reference image. We need to provide the LLM the reference image. For that, we use the LLM Prompt Manager. In the first context input, connect the outlet context of the system prompt. Then, add the image from the image scale node to the second context node. Add now a generate text node for the LLM to create the prompt. Connect the context first. Now we write a prompt to the LLM for it to repair and restore the photo. If we run now the prompt generator, we will receive an error. We need to provide an LLM to process it. Place it in API Provider Selector. Here you can choose from different LLM providers. OpenAI, Gemini, Anthropic. If you are subscribed to them, you can access them from Comfy UI with LLM Toolkit. I will use Gemini and choose the Flash 2.5 model. Connect the node to the context system prompt. And of course, do not forget to add your API key. Now you can run the prompt generator. After a few seconds, we have Gemini creating a prompt for us to restore the photo. We can connect the text to our prompt. I prefer to only copy and paste the text if I am happy, to avoid running the prompt generator all the time.
check that the prompt looks good, and you are ready to go again. As you see, now it has done a pretty good restoration. Of course, fine-tuning the settings can provide you with better results. I recommend you to use the HDR Context LoRa. Download it from the link in the description. Place a LoRa Loader Model Only node. Connect it between the UNET Loader and the K Sampler. Select the HDR LoRa. Don't forget to add HDR as trigger word in the prompt. Photo restored with increased quality with a very simple variation of the Flux Context template. We can do the photo restoration with Quen Edit too. Search for Quen Edit in the image templates. Again, download the required models to use Quen. In the Comfy UI documentation, you have detailed instructions how to use the workflow and where to install the models. We will also work with a quantized version of Quen Edit. We can download one of the multiple possibilities from Hugging Face. Like before, place a Unet Loader GGF node. Now, select the Quen Edit quantized model and connect the node to the model sampling or a flow node. Add the image you want to restore with the image loader. For the example, we are copying the same prompt as we used for context. And we also add the image compare node to visualize the changes in the photo. When ready, run the workflow. LLM Toolkit also has a template for Quen Edit. Try both and use the one you like the most. Quen Edit provides also great results. This case, we do not even require any LoRa. If you want also to colorize the image, just tell the LLM that you want to restore and colorize the photo. Change the prompt and generate text. Replace the prompt with the answer from the LLM and run the workflow. And the old photo has been restored and brought back to life with colorization. Very simple and easy with Comfy UI. I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.